In the case of children, parents play a very important role in helping the child bond with the dentists. This relationship was described in the year 1975 by Dr. G. Z. Wright in the form of an equilateral triangle called the periodontic treatment triangle. According to Wright, the child is the focus of attention to both the parents as well as the dentist. Therefore, the child is placed at the apex of the triangle, while the dentist and the parents occupy the two corners below, forming the base. The arrows facing one another depict the reciprocal interaction between them. This triangle symbolizes coordination between three elements to create harmony and is the successful path to effective and efficient treatment. The triangle was later modified by McDonald in the year 2004 when society was added as a new parameter at the center of the triangle, keeping in mind that society has a strong influence over the behavior of the child. This is called the modified periodontic triangle, where the management techniques have to be acceptable in society. Any variation in the interaction between the dentist child and parent leads to a change in the shape of the triangle. Let us consider two case scenarios. In scenario one, we have a parent who always answers on behalf of the child. The parent is overindulgent or overprotective, thereby interrupting the communication between the child and the dentist. This is depicted as an isosceles triangle, where the patient or child is passive. In scenario two, we have a negligent parent, disinterested in the treatment, walks away during the treatment, and is self-indulgent. The dentist's communication is limited to the child, and the parents are at the passive end. This scenario is depicted as a right-angled triangle. New models based on the periodontics treatment triangle have been proposed such as the periodontic treatment model, which also includes a pediatrician. In this, the most distinct features of pediatric dentistry are included, such as prevention, risk assessment and management, child psychology and behavior management. This model uses a square that has the child in the center. A pediatrician is added to the treatment model as they are the first source of information to the parents. Family and society are other factors playing an important role as depicted in the model.